Welcome to the e-learning for Sage 50, on the topic of prepayment. In business, sometimes you will collect prepayment from your customer, before you fulfill your customer's order. The prepayment collected is actually inclusive of GST. This topic guides you how to enter a prepayment transaction. According to the guide on supply, deposit, whether refundable or not refundable, or in the form of security given, in respect of any supply of goods or services, is not part of the consideration for the supply, if it does not form part of the payment for the supply. Generally most deposit payments represent consideration, as the amount paid over, is intended by the parties to the contract, to be offset against the purchase price, once the supply has been made. Such payments fall within the scope of GST, and tax must be accounted for on receipt of the deposit. To make things easier, in SAGE, a deposit which is not refundable, will be used to offset against invoices, we called it as prepayment. Prepayment is inclusive of GST. When you enter a prepayment transaction, remember to set the type as prepayment and indicate whether it is a local sales or export sales, so that system will apply the correct tax code automatically. Now, you will see that GST amount is calculated automatically. Just that simple. Thank you, and have a nice day.